A record number of tornadoes tore through Oklahoma last year. We averaged 65, but in 2019, we got 147, breaking the old record of 145 set in that deadly year of 1999. Tornado number five, we've seen tornado number five. Tornadoes were just part of the problem last year. Weeks of relentless rains caused historic flooding, testing the endurance of Tulsa's decade-old levee system. The levees held, but many neighborhoods flooded, along with state parks and washed out roads. Residents of Weber's Falls were forced to evacuate, as were some homeowners in hard-hit sections of Sand Springs. In Muskogee, high waters caused the USS Batfish to float again, and the swollen Arkansas River caused these two barges to break loose and crash this dam near Weber's Falls. Right now, you are watching the two barges make contact. Are we in for a repeat of last year, or will we get a break? Right now, the Climate Prediction Center points towards the latter. Their spring outlook leans towards normal rainfall for green country and only a slight chance for a warmer than normal spring. Normally, we can learn a lot about the upcoming season by watching the El Nino or La Nina patterns, but this year, those patterns are fairly neutral, so little insight can be gained. But I do know this, there will be tornado warnings this spring and staying weather aware is critical. When a tornado warning is issued, take immediate action and don't count on all these outside storm sirens. Inside your house, you may never hear it. The best way to get information is on the television or with the Tulsa Channel 8 mobile app. So here's my spring prediction. We will see fewer tornadoes this year than last year, but will still be above normal. I predict 75 tornadoes across Oklahoma. That's about half as many as last year, but it only takes one. Be sure you are ready.